Well, we have with us uh, Mumbai's local player Abhijit Joglekar. Uh, Abhijit, today you beat a WIM uh, yeah. Chandrai Hajra. Yeah. How was your game? The game was, uh, you know, quite exciting, and I just took the advantage of the mistakes that she made in the middle game, especially. And the position was, you know, a little bit unclear till the uh, late middle game, I can say. And it was a difficult game actually. At one stage, you know, I was in a great confusion like what to do now and I wasted around 19 minutes for a move. But uh, fortunately, I just could find a correct solution of that uh, position and um, I just came out of it. Then she went for an, you know, early attack like what you call as premature attack which, uh, you know, doesn't succeed uh, generally. So, I just took the advantage of that and I just, uh, you know, kept on emphasizing uh, on my position, getting better and better. And then, uh, you know, she just, I mean, she just brought her queen to h6 and then she just started her h pawn to attack my king. But, uh, you know, uh, there were no sufficient pieces for, a, for, a, for an ideal attack, you know. So, I, I just could defend stubbornly and, uh, you know, that backfired actually on her. And then her position got worse and worse and then I won some material and, you know, it was a king walk like she shifted her king from king side to the total queen side, that area. But even, even from that she could not survive because she lost so much of material. But at one stage, you know, she got some counter, but uh, I just made the exact correct move at correct time and then... What was that exact move? Sorry? What was that exact move that you made uh, at the correct time? It's a series of moves if you... If, yeah, I, sure. if I can show you the game, then only I can tell you. It was three to four moves that I made very correct at a particular time and those moves were absolutely necessary that I was getting a very good attack but she was getting a nice counter at one stage and you know you have to be very patient like uh, not to give any counter to the opponent so I just had to pause my attack for two or three moves and I just you know made my king safe first and then again I continued with my attack and she just could not bear the pressure that was on the king and you know, she blundered her queen. I mean, she exchanged the queen at a wrong time when I was some material up. And then I just grabbed two to three pawns and then she just resigned actually. Okay. So I'm very happy today to beat after all a WIM after many years actually. <laughs> well, Abhijit, one thing which we know is that when you play these tournaments, yeah. you are not just playing, but also working. We yeah. can see your bag over here. <laughs> you 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 come from work directly, or how yeah, does it? Yeah, I do. I do. You know, when there are two rounds in a day, you know, in the morning time, I just come directly from my house to play the morning round, and then always there is a break of two to three hours. So after finishing my first game, I just rushed for the work. Actually, what do you work? Actually, I have my own business, a small own business of manufacturing certain types of essential oils. And actually, I have no option but to do that. You know, I go for work in that time, that break. And that's the reason why I could play the tournaments even in Bombay. So you mean to say, because you go to work in those breaks, you are able to earn enough income so that you can pay the entry fee, something <laughs> like that? Or why, why it's is not it like that? Why Actually, is it essential it's not like that. for you to go to that work? Uh, the thing is, I am the whole and soul for that. Nobody can, I mean, nobody, I can't afford anybody replacing me mm -hmm. or just looking after my business in my absence actually so i have no option but to at least to be present over there at least for one or two hours okay so that you know i can manage the work and i just give the instructions to my people and allot some duties to them and again i rush for my second round <laughs> so does, does it ever happen to you that no this is too much of a trouble i should not play chess tournaments anymore does that feeling come to you yeah it Obviously, it comes. It has come. I have, you know, lost some games because of that pressure of my work. 
especially the second round because i just don't get the rest for a second between the two rounds but you know i can say that love for my my love for chess my love for game just overcomes everything i just want to play under any circumstances under any conditions so what is it about it. chess that you love so much i just love the game that's all i just love the maneuvering the tactics and you know entire chess game is you know it's a combination of art and science uh, you know and so basically i'm a science student so and you know the things which you understand very deeply that you enjoy also yeah you know so so in a way you are not looking for let's say titles or gaining a lot of rating what you enjoy in chess is the beauty of playing good moves and some nice tactics yes 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 absolutely i am not after any title or anything and because i know that uh, you know it is now very difficult to achieve something i just want to play good chess that's all i am just real chess lover chess fan and Uh, whenever i get some free time from my work and from my other duties i just practice chess that's all but still these wins against strong players do make you happy yes obviously yeah obviously i am very happy even today that i won with w i am after you know many years you can say <laughs> but finally i won that's the truth yeah yes. and tomorrow is another grind you'll have to play the round and then yes. go to work perhaps or go to work first and then yeah, come to the round yeah because tomorrow is only one round so in the morning i will go for work and then after at 2 the round is at 2 2:30 so at 2 o'clock i will just catch an auto from there and i'll just come to the tournament hall and start playing the game that's all well abhi abhijit we are inspired by your love for the game and also hard work thank you so much keep going thank you so much